Good evening, I'm Dawn Timoney. Tonight, police in Upper Darby are searching for the gunman who shot and killed two men during a funeral procession this afternoon. Here's our Jenny Joyce. Police right now are going through surveillance video trying to get a better idea of what happened and who was involved in this double homicide. New tonight, police release these pictures of a man they're looking to talk to about this afternoon's double homicide. If you know who he is, call Upper Darby Police. It was chaos down there. Chaos erupting on the streets of Upper Darby along the Philadelphia border just before 1 p.m. At least one gunman inside of a car opened fire on two men in their 20s who were in inside of a different vehicle, sitting bumper to bumper in a funeral procession on Marshall Road near Powell Lane when their lives ended in an ambush style attack. They were targeted and ambushed right there as they crossed over out of the city of Philadelphia into Upper Darby Township. We believe another vehicle came up alongside of them and opened fire on. Upper Darby Police Superintendent Tim Bernhardt says nearby officers arrived quickly and immediately moved people out of the area. We had the assistance from Philadelphia plus our officers, so we were able to clean the, clear the scene up as, as quick as possible, but it was chaotic down there. Police say the victims were gunned down as they were mourning the loss of a recent homicide victim from Philadelphia. Investigators are working with Philadelphia police and combing through surveillance video in both jurisdictions to get a better sense of what happened out here and who was involved. We have a lot of witnesses that are back at the station now. We're interviewing them, so we're, we're confident that we'll be able to, to, to make an arrest in this. Police are withholding the identities of the victims until their families are notified. Reporting from Upper Darby, I'm Jennifer Joyce, Fox 29 News.